everybody, welcome back to the channel and another episode of It's Jenkins. This episode of It's Jenkins is brought to you by Quick Draw QS, fastest on the draw. All right, so we had a pretty successful mission last episode. That was great. We picked up that uh, Quick Cell mech, the, the Quick Draw. So that's actually getting repaired and coming back very, very shortly. Let's have a look at the uh, command center. We're going to go right into a battle today, I think. We've got a secondary lance that's ready to go. So let's choose something up here. Something a little tougher, I think. High tonnage Marion Lance. Larger force. I don't know if we've got the, the juice to pull that one off. So what are we what's this one here? Uh Tamarin Avery Space. they they've always got top opposition. So they're gonna blow that one up. So that's the standard blow up mission. So they'll have Probably a couple lances to start. I don't know if we got a, if we're good. Uh, maybe we're gonna have the. We'll, we'll bring the Efreet. We'll bring the. Yeah, maybe. Although the lance is untested, that's the that's the problem right now. It's fully untested with everybody. So, um, Marion Patrol. Here we go. Four Skull. Rapid response team to raid the facility. Get our operative out safely. Yeah, we can do that. Able to secure the data she was trying to deliver as well. Oh, of course we can do that. So they should have two lances at the start. Beautiful. Let's take that one. Full salvage because I want shit. We need targeting stuff. And it's the Marion, so we could have quick sell. Who knows, right? Uh, so let's um, uh, load, clear, apply. We're going to be building a new lance here. So let's bring in... Where are you here? You. I'm going to want... With the number of guys that we're up against, I'm going to bring the Avatar. The Vulture with the double racks, I wasn't 100% happy with last time, so I'm not sure about that. Maybe. This guy always attracts undue attention. And maybe, I think we bring the Overheater. Because if there's quick sell, I'm definitely going to want to overheat them. Although, that being said, I think we want to bring the Stormcrow instead for continuous firepower. Because if this battle goes long, the Bushwhackers got three salvos of rockets. And then it's kind of me mediocre at the best of times. If we want overheating, we got the Ifriti, Ifriti, Ifrit and the Nidhogg for overheat. So this is probably going to be a B-Lance situation. Savage Wolf is using Goss. So definitely going to be you. Boomer's been running the Avatar, so let's keep you on that. Road Rash, we can put you on the Stormcrow. Although you've been running what? The Stealth, right, for the longest time. Probably kind of be Bushwhack. Yeah, and then um, Vision on the Vulture because he's got the uh, Controlled Burst to drop recoil, even though this thing's got, like, no recoil issues at the moment. Now you, Venom, you've been piloting the Efreet, so you can go there. I think you piloted the... Yeah, you piloted the Nidhogg once already. It doesn't show up on here, though. Uh, so let's go with that. And I think that's our Lance. We got, we're got we rated at four skulls, so let's do this. Command interface initiated. All right, well, it's this map. So we got the base. We got an interception Lance and then a reinforcement Lance. Although, no, wait, wait a minute. Right. So there's going to be two lances. There's going to be one here and one here. So we got to draw... Oh, that's interesting. Okay. Our flyers are going to be pretty bunged here for the first little bit. Oof, boy. Okay. Uh, we know where the reinforcements are coming from. So what do we got for range? The racks are okay. Stormcrow's got range. Avatar's got range. I'm gonna. It's, I know it's the Savage Wolf, but I'm gonna be calling him the Mad Cat Mark II. I guess is got range. But do I want to like? Oh God, it's so iffy. Um, I'm gonna go down here. 
Because if I go back, I, the trees back here, we got some height. We might be able to pick people off by range. But I think if we close like down here, I know we're in the open here, but we're behind a hill in this mountain. We can hopefully spot one or two of them and, and rip them a new one quickly to drop their numbers down. I don't like that spread. It's just... That's not bad. Uh, yeah. It's going to be a steady rolling thunder mission. Okay, we got something over here. Is that a Jess? Yep. Quick draw, quick sell too. Ooh, nice. Shit. Thank God for AMS. Boy, they really don't like the vulture. Mortar carrier. Clint. Is that a quick sell, Clint? It is. Awesome. Highlander quick sell four. Oh, somebody's getting barbecued their ass. That's for damn sure. Catapult. C-22. Missile and energy build. How do I want to play this? We got three there. And four here, and there's one more somewhere, probably in here somewhere. All right. Okay, this is going to be good. This is going to be good. How do I want to... Who do I want to kill first, and why? The awesome is bad news, but we can hide from him to make him ineffectual at the start. What turn are we on? 16, which means the catapult's gone now. We're going to go after the catapult. Until we can see so. Ooh, what do we got back here? Ultralight LRM carrier. LRM 15 Delta. We got the Thunderbolt only on that. We can leave the Thunderbolt down for now. Until we get a good, like, over 65% chance to hit. I think we'll just leave it off. But we'll fire everything else. AC landed. Both PPCs landed. You got peeps. Looks like you got a light and then a couple of others. Oh, you're hot already. Oh, you got light streak quick sell PPCs. That's why you're so damn hot. That's a lot of armor too. Commander. Oh boy. Uh, can you get some speed up please? Yeah, we're out of range for the racks. This gives the awesome a shot at you, though. We gotta get further this way. Awesome still gets a shot. Do I give my turn up? Let's just hope the range doesn't favor that awesome. Let's just hope he's not as good as he thinks he is. Alright, let's uh, burn the caseless first, I think. Simply because it's it's got the highest uh, jam chance, but our the initial shots are so low in chances to jam that we're better off burning this first. So let's hammer this quick draw. Okay, he's got good damage reduction. I'm receiving you. We gotta get you into battle. Yeah, see what I mean about these things? They're just spotted by everybody. They're good, but All right. I know it's taking our AMS away from our other guys, but we're gonna be moving up into here anyway. I want this thing gone. That's a lot of armor. So I want to go all out and try... Uh, a chance to hit, though. Let's just hit him with tandem. That's a lot of armor. Why he did not shoot is confusing to me. Damn it! I right clicked. I 
freaking hands. Come on. That's where I want to be. Double time. Let's go. Let's go. Oof, brutal. A little better. Yeah. I got no real defense against the mortar carrier. You've got a lock on me. Hey, yo. As long as he ain't shooting at you. You gotta move, buddy. I know we're kind of grouping up here, but we got. I, I can't move very far, so we got to go where we can go. Yep, tag barrage. Uh, I know this guy doesn't have a lot, but if we can kill him fast, that would be good. Really? <sighs> okay. Regular peeps. My old mama can hit harder than that. You don't. No, don't. My mom can hit harder than that too, and she's dead. But you don't say shit like that, man. That's how you get yourself in trouble. Waiting for orders. All right, we need to move you. You got some speed, so I'm okay with that. Okay, this gives me some options. So let's move to here. Understood. Moving fast. All right, AMS protected now. 56. Yeah, a lot lower on you. Yeah, no, I think it's this guy. Let's see if we can get some shots. That's bringing our heat way up, eh? This guy's way hotter than I thought he would be. Like, way hotter than I thought he would be. It's either that or the gosses. Bringing us close to the red line. Acknowledge. Yeah. Yeah, that build may not be viable. Oh, that's the Clint. Okay. Oh, we may be leaning on our uh, flyers here for this. That guy's trying to drop heat. Commander. Because he knows damn well if he doesn't, he's screwed. Let's see if we can get rid of these mortars. Yeah, Stormcrow's like the least of anybody's worries now for them. Alright, uh. Still got a half decent amount of armor, though. Sixty-three. It's only an LRM fifteen, though. These mortars are uh, way worse. Okay, good damage. Hopefully, we can kill that mortar carrier this turn. Wow, we're slow too. Yeah. Well, that's a lot of fun. Yes, Commander. What do you think?
Where's that mortar? Can get him from there. Jeez, really? Oh, it's so brutal. Got it. Drop our instability. That's not bad. That's garbage. That's not bad either. Let's leave you off. You're just becoming a problem. Boy, this is going to be bad for what for ammo. Roger that. It's going to be bad for ammo, that's for sure. Oof. Guy's accurate. Took a hard hit there. What are your orders, Skipper? All right. Roger that, Commander. This Jess has got to go, but I don't have the, the juice to do it at the moment. I got to save my Inferno. It's 170 in the back, eh? I think we got to go with the better chance to hit. Okay, nice. I'd be okay using my missile racks on that guy, though. The Highlanders, I mean, I think the Highlanders got to take the Infernos. Commander. That awesome has got sight on you now. Let's vigilance you. Get some speed. One rotary's jammed already. Really? With like minus 45% jam chance and one rotary's already jammed? Acknowledge. That's your fucking case list for you, man. I didn't want to I didn't want to put it in there, but I didn't really have much choice. Um so let's go with you. I'm gonna use the caseless up. Hammer this guy. No knockdown. Yes, Commander. You know what you gotta do. There we go. I think I might drop all the bombs in this guy. I don't know if this guy's got all rockets. Like, if this Jess has all rockets, he's gotta die, like, now. Like, I don't know what those are. So, let's not mess around with them. Aye. Okay, good. Yeah, if those were rockets, then we were in a lot of like, a lot of trouble. Okay, you need to somehow get away from that. Awesome. And that'll do it right there. We're hot, but this thing sinks heat like a like a you know what, so I'm not that worried about it. Um Let's go all in on this guy, see if we can strip him. Here we go. Here comes the rockets. Didn't get the torso, but we got the knockdown. That should ensure the kill for next turn. Oh, maybe this will do it. Not quite. That's just insult to injury. Yeah, you better back up. We're coming for you next. Shit. Out of AMS range, but I had to move the Efreets in. Losing armor. Receiving you. Alright, you're up this turn. We got one rotary down and one back. Thirty seven, huh? I think we can get him with the flyers. I think we want to try and kill this guy. Oh, that's nice. I'm running the risk. Just, well, you know what? Perfect time for the bolt-on rockets as well. 
running the risk here, but we want to drop recoil, I think. Locked on. That should engine destroyed. Okay, he's done. Spec destroyed. Okay, they're down to six, so it's six on six now. Should be able, uh, we're gonna sick both flyers on that catapult, I think. This guy's gotta go too. Oh, he didn't fire. Beautiful. I don't know what this guy's got. He's obviously direct fire because he's not shooting anything indirect. Where are you? Pair of missiles. Yes, Commander. Why does that scare the fuck out of me? Okay, I want to vigilance you because I'm putting you in harm's way here, but we're going to get up into here because if I can I get copy. you to kill the mortar carrier this turn. Got him. Then I can focus both my flyers on the guy on the hill. These two guys are definitely taking the infernos. Nice try. Okay. Commander? Uh, wait a minute. I guess that's if I sprint, it's technically the jet booster, right? So if I'm not sprinting, it's not the jet booster. Am I right? Probably right. Oh, 85. Nice. Let's get into here. I gotta remember too that I'm gonna have a whole nother lance after this. So we've got Inferno Mines, Bomb Inferno. So I wanna put those in a strategic place. So we'll just fire the tandems on this guy. Come on, give me some crits. Nothing. Alright. Ready to rock. Get into here. Stand four. I don't know how hot this guy is. How hot are you? Not at all. So light AC-10 and the MRMs. Um, yeah, I'll use the improved. I want to get some damage on this guy because we're going to be shooting him from range. So nice, the AC hit. Okay, that'll get rid of his uh, any evasion he might have. Ready for orders. Get around to here. Let's go this route. I'm saving the hag ammo. We've only got like another, what, six turns of firing. Although that's... Uh, God, it could be a good... We might be able to crit this guy out. Let's try it this way. Nope. Damn it. Skipper. Well, that was a waste. All right, Boomer. Uh, you're moving damn slow. Copy that, Commander. I don't like the fact that this guy's got those just two missile hard points. I have no idea what they are. Let's go this route. Ah, oh, PPC hit, though. Ready for orders. Alright, kiddo. Um, um is not a word. There we go. All an air. Get some evasion up and get on this catapult. He's gotta go. He has got to go. Ah, uh, 50% with the thunderbolt though. I think I hold on to it. I'm gonna drop the rockets on though. Gotcha. Come on, get that torso. Damaged it. Not enough, though. I'm out of short-range missiles. Did we get it? Do we have anybody else ahead of this crapapult? Oh, it's 17. They got two guys on 17. Okay. 
Yeah, you better run. Damn it! Fuck! Couldn't get the kill on him. Orders. <sighs> Genuinely disappointing. Although I think that vulture was like under. He's he's um underpowered with those two racks. The racks just don't have the same. Ooh, see ya. They just don't have the same punch they used to have. So a dual rack build really isn't. Unless you've got a lot of other supporting weapons, it's really not that viable. Alright, we're coming for you. We're coming for you, right after we kill that vehicle. I gotta remember follow-up though, right? Because we can come after that guy all we want. Copy that. But if we can't follow it up with the rest of our guys, then overheating him won't do any good. I don't know if he's got a compact cockpit either, so let's hit this guy with tandems. Confirm. Okay, we got the kill. That's good. Wasn't expecting that. Target down. We will take that. Yeah, you know you're in trouble. That awesome is running pretty darn cool. I don't think we're quite in position to capitalize on overheating. Against the awesome, maybe. Do I want to go after this Clint, though? I think so. First, let's grab the Clint. I think I want to... I don't know if I want to use my flyers to activate the uh, bases, though. i got to go this route in the Clint. See what we can get here. Oh, the large improved hit. Or was that the Goss? One of the two. Yeah. Ten four. Was you shooting at me? Was you shooting at me? I think you was. Let's hold that for now. Yeah, he's just a regular awesome. Copy that. He's he's regular awesome. He's not awesome awesome. He's just regular awesome. Show them what you got. I might be able to hold on to those bombs. Oof, good damage. I'm losing armor bad. I saw that. Wow, the more damage these these guys take, the faster they get. You notice that? How's that heat treating you? Still gonna fire, are you? Good damage. Yes, Commander. Where do you think you're going? Thought we had a fight going on over here. Got it. Better targeting on this guy. Wait. Uh, speaking of better targeting, start using this now because, like, I should be. I uh, can't use that, though. Um, do I want to use one of these? He's got streak fours and grenade launchers. The fuck? Roger. Yeah, I gotta change the load on that, too. Standing by. It's shocking how well we're kind of well we're doing given that we don't have a lot of uh, firepower I mean the, the the two flyers have our firepower pretty much right now okay you're still overheating do I want to drop one inferno on you or do I want to just tandem this guy's ass so do you do you have compact no way to know. That's a lot of laser AMSs, though. And a pair of large Rex lasers, eh? How 
How's your heat? Not negligible. I don't understand this loadout. Grenade variety packs. Uh, can't use the mines there. But he's got to be stopped. So if I put this bomb inferno on, all those lasers will go off. Causing heat. Let's just use 110. Right? And the bomb should get through and overheat him even more, in theory. Fire in from a right? My flamer is empty. He's got a big heat bar. Confirm. That's a big freaking heat bar. I'm there. I need this guy gone, please. Leave the barrage till later. God, the targeting. Siren. Orders. So you're damaged on that side. Let's get you around to here. We don't have the heat to keep this guy shut down, though. That's the problem. Let's go this route. That should do some good heat damage. Well, heat to him. AC hit. Inferno bombs went off. 67 heat. Is he over? He's over. Orders? Yeah, fuck you. Uh, no, you need to be in the trees. Roger that. I have a feeling the awesome's going to shoot at you. He might shoot at the flyers, but I doubt it. Thunderbolt 69, let's go with it. Let's see if we can get the kill on this guy. Okay, one side gone. There's a knockdown. Have a seat, buddy. I guess one arm gone, technically, but that's where the streak is, I think. It's got peel and stick. It's not going to save you, though, I don't think. Yeah, he's considering his life choices at the moment. Why the fuck did I pick this thing? Oh, he's a little stealthy, that's why. Huh. That's all you can do, eh? Light damage. Holding firm. That's all he can do. Waiting for orders. Waiting for orders. Go here. Let's go after this guy. Oh yeah. Target's taking a critical hit. Commander. You goddamn right he is. Ah uh, boy. Afraid of those damn streaks, and as well I should be. <sighs> yeah, the only the question is if I go. Oh, that's not bad. Let's do oh boy. I don't think the Highlanders got the movement rate to get me. You know what? Let's do this. Get ahead of them next turn. If we can finish off this Clint right now. That's what I want to do. Highlander's already gone, so... Let's see if we can kill this guy. No, of course not. But Boomer might be able to do it. Or maybe not. That's a way better shot, though. Let's go here. Got it. We're, we're ahead of him next turn anyway. 
So I think we should be able to get him. I want to put a barrage on this guy too. So let's hammer this guy. That's awesome. Just to let him know we're thinking about him. You know, he needs to know we're thinking about him. This guy's cool already, isn't he? Fucking goddamn right he is. I have to move. Yeah, see, I was able to tie that guy up for one turn by dropping the bombs on him, but I, I, just, without follow-up, it's a waste, right? It's a complete and total waste. We don't have a jet booster on this guy, okay. Right side should, in theory, be okay. The only place he could kill us if he double hits the ass end. Uh, I gotta keep this guy roasted. Let's keep him barbecued. I'm on him. Yeah. Okay, that shut him up. Um. Turn that off. You know me. Twenty four chevrons of evasion, though. Five. Oh, that's pretty damn good, though. I gotta save those. The secondary asset has been secured. Excellent. Okay, in theory, the Highlander shouldn't get around to see this guy. In theory. And we're close enough to finish this guy off. Oh my god, really? Our chances to hit just... Oh, because we close... He's got... Right. Yeah. He's got, uh, what do you call it? Stealth. ECM. That thing. Take the better shot. Panicking. I don't know if he'll last much longer. The secondary asset is under fire, Commander. Of course it is. Everything is under fire here, buddy. Good to go. I don't understand how you how you're missing that. Uh, Clint's in a good spot. Got it. I don't know if they're going to get reinforcements now. I'm not convinced that that's going to happen. Uh, let's go this route. See if we can do some crits on this guy. I know he's already taken a head hit, so... Yes, Commander. So if that's the case... Then I'd just like to say... A big F you to this guy. How do I keep him overheated though? You know what? Screw it. Let's kill this awesome first. And we worry about the other guy afterwards. Roger.
Nice. Yes! Okay. All right. All right. I got you. Mr. Pilgrim. Here it comes. This guy's gonna die you. now. Die. Is that a head hit? It was. <laughs> I think it was the tag that hit him in the head, too. Yep, it was the tag that hit him right in the face. Orders. That's just the, hey, we're coming message to him. He just needs to know that we're coming for him. You gotta tell him, right? Like, I mean, it's not fair if you don't tell him we're, we're not coming for him. And of course, it's it's, it's more comedical, too, when you tell him that we're coming for him. And then he takes a tag to the forehead. It's like, oh, shit. Oh, yeah, I forgot about the Clint. <laughs> Whatever. But like, I have to worry about the Clint. All right, we got two bombs left. Let's use them now, using the incendiary missiles. Let's warm this guy up. Firing. Yeah, fuck you. My flamer's empty. Ooh, that's a lot of damage for being at range and being a ground attack. Are you gonna fight or you you are? <laughs> Thanks for showing up. Wait, what the hell just happened? Battle mech power up detected. You shot that down. Something got hit though. I don't know what it got hit. Confirmed. Yeah, Ooh, clan stuff doesn't have minimum range. We'll just step up to this guy. Turn you off. All right, the rest. Yes, Commander. There was a spot here where I could move that a guy couldn't see me. Where was it? I guess not. Okay, I'm gonna pull back because I got minimum rage issues. We'll pull over here, shoot this guy. Well, he's not XL. Come on, bail out. Commander. On my way. Question is, he's wide open. Let's give it to him. See ya. Target eliminated. I'm here. That was a big FU if I've ever seen it. All right, see if he can like, steal go. the kill off the mechs over here. I don't mind. I don't mind in the slightest. Tandems only. Target locked. Critical hit, Commander. Orders. Let's see if we can kill this guy and finish this mission off all in one shot here. This should do it, I think. 77 with the AC. Switching to improved, going for the kill. Oof, not enough. Will you bail out though? Reporting. Yep, there you go. There it is, folks. Good work. I almost feel like a pair of Ultra Tens would make that Vulture more dangerous than what it is right right now. I had to try that rack loadout. I had to try it. And I made the mistake of not switching to the AP ammo. We got cord. Ah, we lost all a bunch of stuff here. Ah, I lost one of the rotaries. It's fine. We're not going to go with a rotary build, I don't think. I think for... If we were hunting medium mechs, the rotary 5 would probably be fine. 
But once you get into the heavier realm, it's just not doing the output that you need. A pair of Ultra 10s on this thing probably would be good against heavy mechs. So you want to contest this. Yeah, you can go screw yourself, man. I need parts, baby. Uh, there's a full catapult, full awesome. Only two parts of the Highlander. I don't think there's... Uh, we don't have any... Yeah, we don't have anything to match it. Wait, why is it not... Usually it shows you anything that you've got... Oh, there's a full quick draw here, too. Well, hello there. As cool as the Highlander would be, I think taking an immediate quick draw... What's this... This guy's a 5-7. Ooh. Do we make the trebuchet the flamer mech and then have two medium speed fire support mechs and the long range mech within the uh, Black Knight? I think that's the way we go. Let's see what else is down here. Light Streak PPCs. So these are bonus to hit recoil of one, ECM jamming. It only fires if it's going to hit, right? So what's the weight? Four and a half tons? It's kind of a trade-off. 25 heat. 540 meters. Medium VSPLs. Variable speed, variable speed pulse laser, right? 90 damage. What were you on? Oh, I'm interested to know. I have to go back up real quick. Was it the right thing to go out? This Jess is 95 tons. LRM long fires and two MML 9s. Yeah, that's it was probably my right choice to go after this guy. Four LRM, like, like that's an LRM. Well, if he was firing the MMLs at the same time, uh, it would be like a 79 tuber. So it was probably a good choice to kill that guy as quickly as we did. VSPL. So, damage based on distance moved. So the more you move, the less damage it does. And the damage drops. So if you're not moving, that's a good weapon. Unless I got that wrong. So the quick sell streaks are the same thing. It's, it, it's a streak per tube, right? So it figures it out per tube and it'll only fire the, the tube if it's going to hit. Which is kind of cool. Fire control system critical. Indirect 2. Yeah, we haven't been using indirect fire at all. 20 regular heat sinks. Quick sale double heat sinks, 11. Hybrid TSM. Probe King. I'm wondering. Oh, I think we'll be okay without the hybrid TSM. I think I've got it on my other mechs anyway. Okay, so what are we going to use? So headgear wise, we didn't really get much. Patchwork tier one. Yeah. So maybe it's another mech part. Although that's kind of this is kind of interesting, but the thirty damage output for forty five uh, four point five weight. We're at a point now where it's like, oh, there's the large Rex laser. It's the same as an X-Pulse, except it has recoil. And this does less, more damage to armor, less damage to structure. Ten percent damage at max range, though, at 600 meters. So you really got to close with this thing. I'm going to drop it in. Because I can see using that. Like if we put that on... I don't know how much the tr weight the trebuchet has. But if we go with flamers and that. Or maybe it's just all heat. Ooh, i got to think about that. There's a full clint. No, there isn't. Um, yeah. It's a quick sell playthrough. So we got to go quick sell. So let's go this route. 
All right, we got an awesome part, catapult part, just part. And that's it up there. Laser AMS quick sell. Uh, mortar 2s we can just go. Case 2 we'll hang on to. Duralast I think we can get rid of. Regular ECM we've got one. We can sell that one. The fuel cell. Ooh, that's a possibility. Let's. We've got one. I'm going to hold on to that one too. 20 heat sinks can go for 5 grand. Those can go. Peel and stick I'll hold on to. I, I do have a bunch, but... Um, yeah, so not bad. Well, that's pricey. That's pricey. But, you know. Ah, oh, boy. Yeah, the Vulture. Well, the Rack 5s. It's just not... Ah, God, I don't know. So you're going to have to go back there. Let's actually organize this how we had it. So we'll, it'll end up being like that for now. Uh, yeah, I think once these two mechs are back, I'm just going to store them. What we'll do is we'll run two two full lances with backup mechs and probably backup pilots. Uh, but I'm probably going to get rid of a few of the pilots too. We're, we're already dropping our, our cost here down. And I got another level of um, upgrade, which will save us another 5% in cost. So... Yeah, I, I mean, this this way at least we'll be able to get mechs back on a timely manner. Let's manage our tasks a little better here. So the Vulture's back in 12. I don't care about that. So let's get the main lance back up to the top. And then we can do Orion and Banner Snatch at the bottom. Vulture's 12 days. Let's bring you down to pass the quick draw. Because we've got four mechs for the second lance already. So we're okay there. I want the quick draw in sooner rather than later. And then let's bring uh, just to see how long it's going to take the other quick draw. Where are you? Actually, you know what? Let's leave him here. Let's leave him here for now. I'm still looking for a pilot, by the way. Uh, we'll leave him there for now. Until this guy's back, and then we'll bring him forward. Because otherwise, I mean, he's going to, like, the repair, like, he's going to be pushed back anyway till after the end of the month. Before his repairs start. So there's no point in bringing him in now and paying for him. Because he's just going to be sitting waiting to be repaired, right? So we'll just leave it. I wonder if I can shorten the time on these two by just stopping the repair and stripping everything I don't know if anything I think the banner snatch would come back the the paralyte ec20s I've got to give that another roll I think cuz I got to we lost one but I do have one as a backup I don't know. Anyway, I'm going to leave this episode here, guys. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, drop a like. If you haven't subscribed, please feel free to subscribe. And please drop your comments in the comment section down below. Until next time, we'll see you later.